To start out with the training process, it starts with, there's a lot of book work. I mean, in general, you're learning a whole new language. There's numerous different codes for the fire side, for the PD side. You have to know all that, have the background. You're learning essentially a new language. You're learning badge numbers. You're learning what we call 10 codes or 11 codes, PC codes. So it's a lot of book work um, to start out and learning the way of Chico PD. After that, you're in the room and you're call taking. You start out on the non-emergency lines with a trainer at all times. They're there for you. No one's going to let you get into a call you're not sure what to do with. We're always there listening. Uh, after call taking, you progress into 911 call taking. Again, your trainer's with you at all times. From there, you'll progress into fire dispatching. And once you have got all that as squared away as, as you can in, in a training program, they'll move you forward into the police dispatching. Again, your dispatcher's there with you and you'll work the radio at numerous different times during the day, day shift, night shift. And it does go into a shadow period after that where you still have a trainer, but you are handling everything on your own. Your it's planned time for fire radio and your planned time for PD radio. And usually that's about nine to 10 months, up to a year, depending with the communication between the trainer and the trainees, there's evaluations along the way to see what, need, what needs to be altered or changed to best fit each trainee. And so it is about nine months to a year, depending on how you progress through the program. Let's go forward.